Ouais. How are you doing? Uh, you're not with the uh, military press, are you? Dalton mm Press, -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, Soul Snatcher uh, Production, uh, Mason County Blog. The, uh, huh? the right of uh, our First Amendment right, right? Yeah, I'm, a bi I'm big on, I'm big on that. Press, right? All right. Yeah. Uh, All right. Yeah, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take a picture without permission. Well, first, first staff. Well, I could if I want. First, first staff. But, uh, no, you can't. First, first staff. Oh, you got to have me there. This is a public no, park. No, no, I mean, that ain't Easter down here. You bet. Well, this is public. Uh, huh? Ah, the alley's a public public area too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm asking you, please. Oh, that you 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 can ask and and, and 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 sometimes I consider that depending on how important I think it is. But I get people I that don't want me taking their pictures all the time, and including the officials, and I take their pictures anyway. Just please don't. Yeah. Don't do what? Okay. Well, that 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 that's different. I'm a paralegal, and I know a lot about where the boundaries are on on photojournalism. Please. Are you trying to give us warning? What the hell is that? Right, that's no, a that's a microphone. Uh, you have it's a microphone, on? huh? Do you have it turned on? Well, it's not recording right now. No, mm -hmm. no. All right, how about that? Well, no, how about that? That's for that's a, that that's part of the First no, Amendment. That's that free expression. Yeah, you could do, you can even do that to a cop. <laughs> I'm not a cop though. No, I just you know, just how about that? But I came over here. Um, I, I figured you guys might be part of the, the some of the St. David's outreach program. Are you guys homeless? No. No? Okay. Why? Well, I'm interested Why in you the ask homeless. Why uh, personal questions? Just uh, to... Uh, do you have any identification? <laughs> well, you're not under arrest, so I, uh, I guess I don't need any. <laughs> well, thank God. You are. <laughs> huh? I said you are. Okay. You're under, I'm going to make a civilian arrest. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, so I wanted to come well, over and, hey, and you, do a story sure about the about the homeless in Shelton, huh? There's nobody here for you. Yeah. 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 We're yeah. so homeless that we take care of ourselves. That's always a good plan. I was up and covered the Occupy Olympia encampment at Heritage Park, and one of the things I noticed is uh, there's an issue on no public restrooms, and the homeless are often. Uh, vilified for not using the public restrooms, but then the city well, officials the lock them out of the public restrooms. So yeah. it's sort of like right. a catch-22. My name's John. You're right. It's John? And it's yeah. not a good thing. What, what millimeter camera huh? is that? I said, what millimeter camera is that? Yeah, I don't know if it has a millimeter thing. It's uh, like a pin tax? Or it, it, it is. It is a pin tax. Uh -huh. yeah, uh, it, what millimeter? Uh, what the lens? I don't know. Yeah. I think that it's a, it's a it's a very it's a it's a what comes out of there, man? Yeah, it's a variable. It's variable. Yeah, <laughs> variable. Uh, Jesus Christ, huh? Hey man, I used to have a one just like that. A what? Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh no, I used to have one just like that. Even better. Is anybody in uh, uh, St. David's Church? here? Yeah, I don't know. Four, four, four thirty. Ask Jim. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he didn't want to be interviewed, four. so. No, we don't <laughs> want to be interviewed. No, I, I, mean, I can't. I can't make anybody talk to me. So. But we're talking. Yeah. We're yeah. just not saying much. Well, that's fine. But um, yeah, I, I, I felt like. If you're polite the, the, and you tell these people that you'll respect them, then I they'll guess. give you more. Well, I, 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 I usually make that effort, but I, I run into public officials telling me that I got to have their permission to, 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 to photograph, and I, I tell them, tell them that that's, it's not the law. It's not the law, but yeah, yeah. that's what we say, and that's what we feel, and that's yeah, how we yeah. think, and yeah. you should uh, respect us, or else we can just kick your ass and take the camera. <laughs> That'd be dangerous. Yeah. yeah. And it might happen. Well, so but at least respect you for that. Okay, look, I'm trying to be your friend. I don't know what your name is. I didn't ask. But what is your name? But when you start 
threatening people, well, that's hey, that, 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 that's, all, that's uh, then you're something. crossing the line. We're asking you yeah. very nicely to be polite. Well, that wasn't oh, nice. That's, that's a threat. threat. Uh, I don't yeah. believe so. Huh? It is a threat. The uh, uh, crap. What's your name? You don't, oh, and I'm going to tell you. It doesn't give you carte blanche. Look, we're asking you not to take our pictures. Don't threaten me. We're not asking threatening you. you. Don't threaten me. Sir, he is <laughs> not threatening you. Yeah, just because you had the press. Uh, you know, I'll uh, take that fucking camera and shove it up your doesn't, ass. Doesn't mean anything. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. I'm being assaulted and threatened uh, with bodily harm over here at the park, uh, Brewer Park, right across the street by St. David's with uh, where the post office is. There's a gentleman with a white hat. I asked him repeatedly. <laughs> yeah. Huh? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I had a camera. I'm a photojournalist. My last name's Smith. Yes, I do. Uh, yes, but uh, this guy's here right now, and he's uh, threatening me, and he's got people with him. Huh, I'm, I'm sorry, what? Yeah, he, he's white. He's got a white hat on. He's got a green vest. Now. He's about in his mid thirties to late thirties. He's about five foot eleven. Medium set, medium build. And it's uh, white sleeves, a green uh, vest uh, in the middle. Yeah, he's still hit, sitting on a park bench here. Uh, gray or light gray and uh, white tennis shoes. Uh, but there's only one park bench and it's immediately adjacent to the alley by St. David's. Uh, he threatened to kick my ass. I have an audio recording of him and um, um, and, and threatened to hurt me. And, 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 and he threatened to take my camera. He didn't touch me, he threatened me verbally. I'm sorry, what? Okay, I'm, I'll be here, thank you. Yeah, I'm turning you into the police. Stay away from me. That film's going to be mine. You want a bit? You're being recorded, sir. I don't care. I have my rights. The police will be here in about two this minutes. Is private property. You just take some fucking pictures of me on my private property. No, this isn't your private property. No, it is. No, now listen. He has a point. Yeah, no, he's not right. Uh, I have a this point, too. He's a good guy. He doesn't want that. I don't yeah. Know. Yeah, let's go. It's all good. It's all good. My daughter works for this county. <laughs> well, that's good. Uh, then she'll know who, uh, yeah, she'll, she'll, know. she'll know about the restraining order. There is no restraining order. There will be.
Hi, are you with St. David's? No, I'm not. Oh, okay. I am, yes, sir. Hi, I was just threatened and, and uh, several times and I asked the person not to and he just walked into St. David's okay. and uh, he said he's going to kick my ass, he's going to take my camera and... Uh, what was his underlying reason for being so upset? Just out of the blue or you taking pictures of him or...? Well, uh, I took a picture of him after he threatened me but I was talking to some people I wanted to cover uh, the fact that there were homeless people here and, sure. the, and lack of public restrooms and this. Uh, no, the guy right there, that's him in the doorway. And, and, and so I said, well, they said, you know, you can't take our picture. I said, well, this is a public park. Yeah. I could if I want to. Yeah. And they said, well, you know, we don't want you to. And I said, well, you know, a lot of times I consider that. I said, sometimes I take even public officials' pictures without their permission. Yeah. And uh, so I s tried to explain that to him. He got very belligerent. Okay. He threatened to kick my ass several times. I said, please don't threaten me. I have this all on audio. We're being recorded right now. Okay, thanks, Tony. Okay. And uh, when he insisted, I backed off and I called 911. And then, of course, they all got excited. I'm going to have, I'm going to fill out a restraining order and have him serve, but I don't know his name. I asked him his name. Do you want to give it to him? And no, yeah, of course not. I can't make him give it to me, right. but uh, I did take his picture. So you want to pursue charges for the threat against huh? him? I want, to, I want to press charges, yes. Okay. So I, I don't threaten people. No, nope, you should. And, and uh, it, it's assault, even though he didn't touch me. No. And, and it's also um, uh, criminal harassment. Correct. And uh, uh, I don't get away with that. I don't no. do it. And I, I sometimes I feel like a little education goes a long way. And I tried, tried that approach. It didn't work. Can I give you a statement for him to fill out real quick while I go talk to him? Sure. Thank you. That's right. You're on public property, sir. Do you have a pen, sir, or do you need a uh, I, I don't have a pen. I don't write very well. I have kind of shaky okay, hands. Could you help me? I can yeah, sign absolutely. it, though. You know, I'll, I'll make it a little easier for you. I'll do it on tape recording. Okay, okay. Do you have him threatening you on recording? Yes, I do. You do? Yes. Is there a way we can review that? Yes, I can send that to you. I'm, uh, I'll have to get it home. It's uh, going to be an MP3 format, but I, if you give me a card, yeah. uh, I will send it to you unedited. What's his story, Matthew? Uh, it sounds over? like he was sitting in the park over here. This gentleman took a, a picture of him. He asked him politely not to take the picture of him again. We went ahead and took another picture of him and that. Mm -hmm. I only took pictures of him actually after he threatened me, but uh, because then at that point I'm gathering evidence. I could have taken pictures of him before then, informed him of that, uh, but I didn't just out of courtesy. And what, was the, what were the threats he made to you? That he was going to kick my ass, that he was going to take my camera and smash it, and he said it more than once. I asked him not to threaten me. And you took that to be a valid threat? A sincere threat that you were going to be. Well, I was afraid. Yeah, I backed off. All right, let me go talk to him. And he had several people with him. Okay. Well, he's got people. He's got witnesses saying about him and say that. Well, I, I got it all on audio. And I told the guy. Right here, yeah, I'm sorry, what? Have a seat right here. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to give you a quick statement from you. All right. And if you can give me a card and a way to contact yep, you. All right.
actually, he's not the only one that threatened me, but he's the one that persisted. Sure. Did you get your ID with you, sir? I know. blog okay. you know, my 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 uh my news organization i'm licensed is um, soul snatcher productions but i don't have any more privileges as no. a news journalist than you have as a private correct, citizen correct do you want john do you have a contact address yes for you? go ahead yeah uh, p.o box seven To do some things here. All right, go ahead. <laughs> and I, I, I will if I have your email. I'll send you anything you need. This is a reporting statement for a victim. Assault case number 12-S is in Sam 00719. Uh, location is Brewer Park on Franklin Street. The date is January 26, 2012 at 16.04 hours. This is the statement of John Smith, date of birth 8. Okay, did you call the police today? Yes, I did. Can you please explain to me in your words what happened that led you to call call for our services? I was assaulted and threatened by this gentleman. I don't know his name. And uh, he threatened me several times, even after I asked him not to. And I was uh, I became fearful that he was going to hurt me. He said he I was going to take my camera, he was going to kick my ass, that he was going to take my camera and smash it. And uh, and so I, I backed away across the park so you know to try to put some distance between me and him and I called the police. Oh, okay. And uh, again, you were in a public park just taking photographs? Well, I wasn't taking any photographs until after he threatened me. And then I took his picture because I wanted evidence of who it was that threatened me. Okay. And right now we're kind of by the, in between St. David's Parish and the you're alleyway. In the, you're in the alleyway. Yeah. Right? Was it over there by the school or where were you exactly? It was, right, it was it was right there by where the, the park bench is where they're sitting. Okay, for the audio, uh, it's basically in the, in the main parking area on a parking bench. Hmm. Um, and you, you never know, you don't know this person? You never no, met I never heard him before in my life. I, 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 I mean, I really, I came down, my purpose was to cover a little bit of story about the homeless. I was concerned about the homeless, that they don't have any public restrooms available to them 24 hours a day. Okay. Uh, the, they said they didn't want to be interviewed, and I said, well, I can't make you talk to me, and, you know, if you don't want to be interviewed, that's, that's fine. But I did uh, inform them that uh, as a technical matter, as a matter of law, that I didn't need permission uh, uh, legally to photograph people in the park, but I didn't bother because uh, uh, it's just out of courtesy. But uh, I did inform that legally that wasn't a, re a prerequisite. Okay. And, sir, is it, is it my understanding you do want to pursue harassment charges against this subject? Yes, I do. Okay. And again, you stated in your statement before, but uh, you, you've recorded this yourself on your camera? Oh, I, I have it on audio, yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's something you could provide to me at a later time if I give you contact information via email? So certainly. I don't have anything to hide. Okay. All right. Uh, is there anything else you want to add to your statement? Uh, no. It's, it's an, I don't really bear this gentleman any animosity, but this is a public park, and I do feel that it should be safe for the public uh, where we don't have to be threatened. You know, just to exercise our First Amendment rights. No, nope, I would agree with you. Okay, that's going to conclude our statement. Time is 16.06 hours. The date is January 26, 2012. Just one second. John, what am I doing? I'm going to give you a case number. Yeah, and, and, and your car, can I ask your name? Yeah, Mike Steele. Let's get you on the car here. Mike? Yep. Is that, is that okay if I call you yes, Mike? Sir. Okay. Uh, you can contact me via email or the phone number. Yeah. With that information. Also, you can come down to the police department tomorrow and get a copy of the report so you can have his information. Well, I want to get a restraining order yeah. against this man so that he doesn't approach me again because he did approach me up here on the sidewalk to the church in a threatening manner. Okay. And that's why I'm going to give you his case number. You can go down to the police department tomorrow and get all his information. Okay. So can, uh, all right. That. This is the case number, sir. All right. And I'm going to cite him for uh, harassment today. Thank you. Uh,
I think a little education goes a long way. And unfortunately, some people are just uh, hard cells. No, I, I hear you. Uh, you want to welcome you free to leave or you can hang tight? Well, I want to go into the church and I want to ask them about their, their, their shelter program for the homeless. Okay. But uh, it's private property. You know, if they tell me they don't want to talk to me, I'm going to leave. But I've been to St. David's before. It's pretty, they're pretty good people. Yeah, them. I like them. Is that, is that okay if I walk up the ramp now Because while you're here? That's fine. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. I'm going to walk over to the soup kitchen on the other side near Coda, I guess, and see if anyone's there before okay, I leave. So we're going to, uh, unfortunately, you know, this isn't a felony, so I can't book one to the jail, but I can issue them a criminal uh, citation. Yeah, I know. I, I understand that. Okay, just letting you know. That's all. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm a paralegal on other things. Oh, okay. So, so you're aware of it now? Yeah. 